and roof collapses. Our Justin Michaels has been reporting almost nonstop on this storm from the Buffalo suburb of Cheektowaga, and he joins us live with the very latest. Justin? Well, Steve Alley, the new totals are in Cowsville, New York. You ready for this? 88 inches of snow. That's a jackpot winner for this snowstorm. Uh, the closest next one is in Lancaster, New York. That one came in at 74. So Cowsville really was the winner when it comes to the jackpot for snow totals. But don't get me wrong, every community around here certainly has their fair share. But a few miles away, we're only talking a few inches of snow or no snow. It's been interesting to talk to people when they say, hey, I have no snow at my house at all. And they come and they see this. There's no uh, there's no plow work done here. This is a straight shot right across this yard here. We're talking three, three and a half, four feet of snow, and they're seeing this all over the place. And it's because of this that there are some concerns coming up on Monday. Let's talk about the weekend. Uh, Saturday in the 40s, Sunday, upper 40s. Monday, we're going to see temperatures here in the greater Buffalo, New York area in the 60s, and they're also expecting rain. Because of that, there is some great concern about what's going to happen to people with flat roofed homes and, of course, businesses with flat roofs. That extra weight, of course, the melting snow compacting, hit by the rain, and that's going to saturate that snow. We're talking about the weight of all this going up substantially. So what's going to happen? While they think there's going to be flooding, they pretty much say that's imminent. But what's going to happen with structures? We've already had some structure collapses. We've had lots of roofs buckling. When you add all that extra weight, a lot of people have a lot of concern. So we're just going to have to see what happens over the next few days here in western New York. All eyes are on this part of the country, of course, not just because of these snow totals, but what's next? A lot of unknowns as we move through this weekend and into next week. Live right now in Western New York, I'm Justin Michaels, NECN.